I am Zelda. You don't have to look so sad. We actually find it to be quite libel. I mean, it's perpetual twilight, really, all that bad. Midna, this is no time for levity. The Shadow Beasts have been searching far and wide for you. Why is this? Why indeed, you tell me. Time has grown short. The guard will soon make his rounds. You must leave here quickly. So, hello everybody, everyone, four. welcome back to Twilight Princess in the last episode. We made it to this, well, we continued to go through this weird area. We found Midna. We found out that uh, there are spirits of soldiers in here, and nothing much, really. I mean, we've, we've made it up to, obviously, the Twi Twilight Princess, known as Princess Zelda. So, now, it's time for us to head out. And man, that, that is awesome. Not that way. The card's coming. Boy, he's prompt. That's awesome that they know where to exactly go. It's crazy. I do like this music. The music sounds so eerie and sounds so different. I can't fly! Girl, are you crazy? Well, do you know do you understand where we are now? Obviously. I guess I promise I guess a promise is a promise. So I'll let you go back to where you first tumbled into Twilight. But are you really sure you you should be going back? Are you sure you aren't forgetting anything important? Oh, wow, that's great. Do you want to save them? Well, in that case, little Midna would be happy to help you. But, well, you have to be my servant. And like a servant, you'd have to do exactly as I say. Why don't you go back, take a little time, and give it some thought. Um, uh, okay, that's fine. And now they spit us out right over here. Back where we first started, and we're still a wolf. Why well, must we still be a wolf? Oh, that's right, I forgot to mention one thing. Though you may have left the darkened realm, you haven't transformed back into your former self, and you won't anytime soon. Now, why could that be? See you later. Oh, that's... No, you're mean. You're terrible, Midna. Um... He <laughs> can't swim. Alright, so maybe if we head into town, we'll figure out what we need to do. So, um... What next? Oh, she's our shadow. Did you think I disappeared? Listen, there's another thing I forgot to tell you. Don't think you can just run off and save your friends because you can't. Just beyond that bridge, the land is covered in twilight. Last time, a shadow beast pulled you through the curtain of twilight. But if you want to go that way this time, you'll need the cooperation from someone from the twilight like me. So you really have no choice but to do what I say. Saving your friends and all that, well, that will depend on your actions. Because you never can trust words you know. Right now, I want a sword and shield that will suit me. You do understand me, don't you? So what do you plan, on, plan to do? While you're here, darling, the twilight continues to expand. Come on, hurry it up. Alright, so what we're actually supposed to do is we're supposed to head 
back into... No. These enemies... Let's take them out. They're no problem. These enemies are basic enemies. Nothing too tough. They're basic bitches. Alright, so let's head back into town because that's where we're supposed to go. La-di-da. Ordon Village. Oh, all these enemies are here. My, he didn't see it coming. Hey, y'all, this is my house, bitch. Get away from my house. Rude. Anyway, all right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to continue to wait. Oh. Mr. Squishable, thank you for taking care of those bad guys. They made both the village and the forest a mess. They kidnapped the village children. But I know you're not one of them. I can tell because you smell like the trees of Ordon. If you run into any animal, tr any trouble, try talking to the animals. We animals understand one another, so you'll be all right. Oh. Um. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Squirrely Squirrel. So, here we go, guys. We can actually talk to animals now. Which is pretty cool, I guess. And here we are back at Ordon Village. Oh, how did it come to this? The children, please say nothing's happened. Please forgive her, your good-for-nothing father. You stupid good-for-nothing father. Alright, so I guess we gotta, guess we should look around. And just a little heads up, stay away from the townsfolks because they're not used to seeing wild wolves running around. So, just a little heads up and be very cautious over here. Oh, about that shield. Hey, not so loud. Let's uh, creep into the conversation over here. It came to it as we discussed. I came to it as we discussed. I checked as we discussed. So that shield is still in your house, right? Uh, yeah, it should be in our storage loft. Good, go grab, go grab it quick as you can. Russell, go wound up pretty good, bro, pretty bad. Got wounded up pretty bad. Blah. So he can't go search for the tr kids. I'll take over for him. But Russell had a sword, Mayor, and he still got hurt. If you're un unarmed, you're done for. I'll be fine. The sword we were going to present to the world royal family should still be at Russell's house. Oh yeah, alright. I understand, Mayor. I'll hurry up and get that shield. You just wait here. No good! Run! Oh my god. That's not a, not a bad bit of information you heard, huh? Uh, look at the open window. This village is full of idiots. So... We should jump up there, but from where? Alright, so... It gave us a little hint we should jump up from... MONSTER! You've returned for more, haven't you? My my daughter, return her! And take this! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh god, the falcon's after us. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez, really? Okay, so you want to escape from here, you want to escape from the crazy animal. Pretty much how you want to do it. So, um, I believe you can actually go into some houses and explore to see if they got any stuff in here. So, that's pretty helpful. I, think, I, I believe there's a house you can actually go into. Oh, there's a chicken. We can talk to animals, so... Oh, Minda, what do you want? Hey, that guy out there, don't just ignore him, do something. Can I talk to the chicken? Chicken! Ah, oh, to be a wolf on a night when the moon rises high. Beautiful, tell me, is your true form a human who is not currently in the town? Nah, just teasing. You're lucky. Your sharpened senses and your soft looking coat, lovely. Okay, so Minda told us to do something about this guy. 
so. Jeez, uh oh. I might die. I might die from this falcon. Come on, let's get up on that roof from here and scare the guy. Look at him, posing like he's all important. Wait until he sees us. Oh, thank God. Oh. You're in trouble, dude. Whoa! Where'd he go? Oh my God. And jump from here, up here, and sweet. Now head inside. <clears throat> the guy just jumped in the water. He's like, forget it. I'm done. I need some health. Bad. Well, not really bad. Is there a Smashing pumpkins. Oh, thank goodness. Found it! Found it! Oh, wall. And, uh, shield. And it should fall. Bam! There it goes. That's the shield. Sweet. Da 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 da! We got the Ordon shield! It looks kind of cheap. Alright then, next is a sword. Hurry up and go get one. Well, thanks. Anything else in here we can find? Smashing pots, smashing pumpkins. Smash. Cool. Um, I need to get out of here. Can I climb? Cannot climb. Can't go through the door. Okay, Midna, I need your help. I. Damn it! There we go. What was that sound? The children could not have returned, could they? I must go out and search one last time. You go inside. I have placed the sword that was to be our gift to the Hyrule on the couch. If the mayor comes for it, please give it to him. But darling, your injuries. All right, so, as you can tell, we shall head inside, inside their house and try not to be seen, really. That's Sounds like the sword that was supposed to be the offering to Hyrule has left on top of the sofa. The people around here are so nice. I think we can just take it. No, where are the people? Where are the people? Wait, are they? I think you actually want to go around them. Other way, other way, other way. I think we go over here. Oh, right here. Yeah, I actually want to start digging right here. So, let's dig. And we're free! Oh, a picture of their kids in their drawing. Pick up the sword. We got the Ordon sword. The sword crafted by Russell. The best swordsman in Ordon as a tribute to the royal family. Sweet. All right, so now you have a sword. Looks like you can actually be useful when you come. Uh, all right, no more detours. I'm going to take you back to the twilight. Go back to the woods where you first transformed to the shape. All right, so she wants us to go back into the woods and start our journey, I guess. Oh, we're dirty now. I'm Mr. Chicken. Oh, she's right there. Oops. <laughs> Alright, go for it, dude. Go try to save the whole entire world. And this is where we want to go, right? I believe this is where we want to go. I hope so. Damn it, went to Ordon Ranch. Oh, well. Um. Well, guys, in the next part of Twilight Princess, we will actually uh, be heading off to... The, um, the woods where we first went to the twilight and hopefully find a way to transform ourselves back to normal. So, if you guys like the video, you guys can subscribe to the comment. I'll see you guys next time. I'll see you guys then.